Hi, this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to turn off Instagram autosave. Did you know that Instagram actually autosaves? So when you do a post on Instagram, it automatically saves it, saves it to your actual device you're posting from. So it actually, when it's saving it, it's actually using the storage space on your device. I'm gonna show you how you actually can stop it from autosaving every time you do a post. Because the pictures I send are usually on my phone anyway, so I don't, know, I don't need a copy of it. Because what it'll do is copy another one to your phone and it fills up your storage space really fast. So before we get going on this, uh, please hit the like on this video. It really helps out our channel. Also hit the subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. We come out with one every week. So every Thursday you should see a video from us. So we don't want you to miss that. So make sure you check those two boxes. All right, let's get on to how to turn off Instagram autosave, which is really important. It helped me a lot with my storage. So go to Instagram like we always do. All right, once you're on Instagram, you're gonna to look to the bottom right and hit your profile image. We're gonna hit that. And now we're on the profile page. We're gonna to go to the top and hit the three lines. And tap that. And when you do that, you wanna to go to settings right here at the top, very easy, hit settings. And then when you're in settings, you wanna to go to your account. So you're gonna tap on account. Once you're under account, once I let this thing not blur on you guys. Uh, okay, here we go, Woo, there we go guys. Woo, okay, we're gonna angle it, there you go. Almost there, guys. Sometimes this thing blurs. There we go. You're going to go down to original posts. It's right here. I want to make sure you guys saw that. So original posts is what you're looking for. So you tap on that. And this is the screen that shows you your original posts. Now see how it says save original posts, save posted vid photos, save posted videos. Saving videos to your phone uses more storage space. So that's why I'm here. You can turn off the top one, which doesn't automatically save the un- edited photos and videos taken with Instagram's feed camera. So that will do that. I don't like having that on. I don't use the feed camera that, well I do, but not often. Usually it's just with pictures off my phone itself. Um, you can turn that off. You can turn off all these features. Now it won't save any of the photos, the posts, anything you do, videos. It won't save it to your device anymore. I think that's great when you don't have a large storage space on your device. So this is how you actually turn off Instagram autosave so you don't get duplicates every time because most of us, most of us I think, if I'm wrong let me know down in the comments, um, take pictures from our phone and videos from our phone to post on Instagram. We don't normally use the reel, I don't myself, the, picture, the camera off the Instagram, I usually take what I already taken, so that's how that works. So that's how you do it, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Hit the like, subscribe, notification bell. And yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you turn off Instagram autosave. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to check out davescomputertips.com, uh, where all, all our articles are, and make sure to subscribe to this channel. And thanks for watching.